Hey, what's up guys? Prince Vitsum and welcome to my channel again. And today we have an interesting base design for you guys. And it's designed for a little group. Now, this base is going to include our door pushing mechanic with the roofs. And I'm going to show you how that works in a little bit. And we also have a lot of space in this base. We also have a boiler. And we have a bunker, which is pretty roomy. Alright guys, so the roof pushing mechanic trick is uh, very easy to use. All you gotta do is just stand there, see you cannot get past it. And you have to use the doors to push you inside. Boom, see when you open the door it pushes you inside. And again, if you want to get out, it's blocked, nobody can go through it. So you gotta use the other door to push you in again. So this is very effective against people that want to go deep on you. This will buy you a lot of time, so be chills, be careful. Alright guys, let's get straight into this base design, man. Now we're gonna start off with a 2 by one That's the cool part about this base. You can just have a simple little starter base, like your good old 2 by one Now after we made the 2 by one we're gonna expand with one square out of the doorway. And then we're gonna make our uh, triangles here for our bunker. So two of those triangles have to be raised. So this is going to be our bunker base for later on, but you might as well make it now. All right, after that, now we're gonna make our footprint. I'm gonna show you guys a footprint. And at the moment this is very cheap to do, but we're gonna close up this whole base now. And it's very cheap to do. Now as for this part here, we're gonna break that. You can leave it on if you want an extra room, but I'm gonna place a boiler in there. So make sure not to place a square there. And close up the base. Don't forget to make those two triangles. Those are very important. They have to be armored uh, as soon as possible. All right, so the base is done. Now we're gonna make our roof system here. Now I'm gonna show you something here. If you place the roof and you wanna place these triangles on top, you cannot because uh, the roof bugs it out. So we cannot place the roof now. We gotta place the, the, the triangle roofs uh, first. And then we're also gonna cover up this foundation here. I don't want people to see this. So we're gonna cover up uh, with some foundations. But here you cannot place the foundation because there is a, a triangle floor on top. So remove the triangle floor, place the triangle uh, foundation, and now you can place the triangle floor back again. It's a stupid order, you know, rust uh, base building. It's not 100% uh, good, but uh, yeah, that's the way to do it. And once you did that, now you can place your roof, upgrade it to stone, place a wall inside of there, place two doorways, and bada bing bada boom, you got your system going on man, it's that easy. Place your doors, and now you can push yourself in and push yourself out. Alright, now we're gonna close up this front part here. Keep in mind you can do, you know, the front side you can do whatever you want. Uh, you can make it bigger, but you know, that's just my way. All right, so now we're gonna place some uh, triangle foundations on the outside because we're gonna honeycomb uh, the base. We gotta add an uh, extra layer. You can add more, but for the time we're just gonna place one, you know, just one layer. And for the time being also keep it stone. Now as for the top here, we're gonna make these three squares here. We're gonna make an armored because that's our uh, our bunker room. Now, that's a very important room. And then the rest we're gonna yeah honeycomb the top as well. You can do that with stone. It's uh, you can do it. You can leave it with stone, but you know that's all up to you.
All right, so the base is already finished, man. Check this out. It's already done and it's that easy. And we have this little mechanic here, which is pretty cool. Check this out. Bam, dude. You'll be the only guy in the whole server to have this mechanic. And there you go. We have a lot of room. You can do whatever you want. You can place more garage doors. That's all up to you. But uh, as for the garage doors in the bunker, I would definitely use them. Because the bunker, this is the most important room. And I highly advise to make this all uh, armored. You just do it little by little, you know. Because this is your most important room. And when you close it, you place a twig, upgrade it to wood. Place a, uh, a floor here, triangle floor, make it armored. And now you can log off and the whole base is armored, the bunker part. And in the morning when you get on, you spawn in your back and then you soft side that wood. That's done in like a minute. You destroy it and boom, you can get out and you can play your game. Now, another very important thing is this roof. You can only keep it in stone or armored, not in metal. See, if you make it metal, you can get through it without the doors. So everybody can get through it. So either stone or high quality armor. I advise armor, it's just better. And there you go. It's that easy. All right, guys, that was the base design, man. I hope you love this design. And uh, yeah, the next videos will be at uh, trip bases as usual. I'll catch you there. Peace.